Hey peeps, welcome to part 15 of Simon the Sorcerer 2 with Pixie. Um, come a long way now. The end is very near peeps, I can say that. Um, anyway, we have just entered the Goblin Camp. Now, we're going to take a peek in this big tent first. Because there's some things in here we need. Right, we want some food rations. some pepper in there too. We need some pepper. Right. Right, we want to talk to this guy here, the elf that's caged up. Alright mate. Oh, a human. How simply barbaric. Excuse me? Phil, anything has to be better than those repulsive goblins. Oh. They make one stomach turn. <laughs> and as for the ogres, well... Uh, and just look at my nails! I haven't had a manicure in days! How is one supposed to live in these conditions? <laughs> well, it simply is quite repulsive. Look, I... When was the last time you had a bath? Uh... I don't know. I, I left my diary at home. Oh, how repulsive. Keep away from me, you filthy beast. Ah, charming. Are you an elf by any chance? Can't you tell? Has one been in this vile cesspit so long? Well... I've never seen an elf before. We try and avoid animals like yourself. One finds one can never quite get rid of the smell. Charming. Animals, eh? Oh, how positively barbaric. One feels quite faint. Oh, dear. Why are you in there, anyway? Those foul goblins captured me. Hmm. They want me to make clogs for them. Oh, yeah. I forgot that all elves are shoemakers. I have a shop nearby where I keep my equipment. I usually carry mine around with me. What a typically revolting comment. Anyway, I was wondering if you could do one a service. Maybe we can, and maybe we can't. One would be honoured to assist you, oh noble elf. What I would like you to do is this. Could you find some perfume for one? It may help alleviate the smell somewhat. What do I get in return? I have this piece of wood. Just what I've always wanted. Where do I sign? Actually, Simon. I want something feminine. Chanel Le Sank would suit one ideally. Oh, here's my old bottle so you can get the right one. Right you are. Hurry. One doesn't think one can stand it much longer. Right. Now there's a specific sequence we have to do, peeps, and we have to do it quick. Because it's extremely delicate. Right. We need to... This one you don't need to do so fast. You can put the soda in the perfume bottle. That's all well and good. I filled the perfume bottle with soda. It's this next bit you need to do quick. Right. Um, what do we need to do? We've got pepper... Food... Right, that's it. We've got a pepper and a hanky. So you need to use the pepper on the elf. And then... Oh, and me without a handkerchief as well. Right, quickly give him the hanky. I've got a hanky for you. Thank you, dear boy. One is most grateful. And then give him the perfume bottle. Here you are. And that should be it. Oh, how wonderful. Yes, we've done it. And here's your reward. Oh, thank you so much. Simon! Now be off, you repugnant little creature. Up yours, Nancy boy. <laughs> right. Let's explore more of this goblin camp. I bet some stuff. <laughs> I see some stuff. As you can see, they're betting. You go first. 
I get two points. You go. I get two sixes. I win. You not play fair. You was always getting two sixes. That's because I is better than you is. I can roll dice better. You no, that's because you're cheating. Oh, you know right. What you know more. Right. You is calling me cheat. You is now what we need to do my honesty. is we oh, no, pour no, 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 the soda on the fire. I was saying you was honestly a scabble. Then we need to pick up the stuff. And we need to do it quick. Before they open their eyes. That's better. I can... Who's stealing the stuff? Not me! Not me! Give Ooh. me my stuff! I know take it! I know take it! And who is taking it? <laughs> the invisible goblin? I know Oh dear. Anyway, while we're here, we'll have the dice as well. Right. Since the closest exit is this way, we'll do that. Ooh, hold on. What's down here? Ooh! Now that's the entrance to the temple. We don't need that yet. But we will come back to it. Because we'll need it in a while. Right. Keep going, keep going. Gotta go the long way, it looks like. Right. Time to complete some promises. Go into the dark woods. Now, finally, we have some food for this guy. So, we'll give him the food rations. Get your laughing gear around this. Nom nom nom. Is that good? And then we'll give him. Oh, yes, I forgot. Give him a soda. Get your laughing gear around this. Now, this is a little mean, but we do need to do it to get his magnifying glass. Hey, come back here. Stop ignoring us! Oh. Whoops! Oh dear. Right. I'll pick up his magnifying glass. Right. Now we've got the block of wood. We'll give it to the woodburn and they can make us something out of it keep the change and just what is that supposed to be uh fortress of evil still under construction it looks like a set of teeth to me that's uh with the tourists at the moment. Great. <laughs> Take it anyway, Simon, because we know someone who needs Next some teeth. Next time I want an ornamental wood carving, I'll know who not to call. Have a nice day. Right. Now we've got everything, we can return to the witches, can't we? Right. We've got something for each of them. Right. We'll give the wooden teeth to her since she can't talk properly. I thought you might like these. There we go. That's much better than 
conch horn. You're welcome. Right. Give the conch horn to the deaf one so she can hear. I thought this might be of help. What did you say, boy? I said, is this any help? Much better. Much better. Alright. Right. One more witch to help. Let's get on. Give the magnifying glass to the short sighted witch. Then hey. they can all cooperate. Are you talking to me? This way a bit more? Yeah, give this a try. There we go. Hey, I can see. <laughs> Here you are. Read the incantation. Hubble, bubble, toil and trouble. A fire hot. And cauldron bubble. Continued over leap. Beware <laughs> this potion. Continue over leap. You shall be turned into an insert animal of your choice. That's a bit of a strange ending. That's what it says here. I think you're meant to say the name of an animal at that point. Oh, right. Which animal? I don't know. An ass or something is the usual thing. You could say pig. It rhymes with swig after all. Everyone does pig. Let's do a dog instead. Very well. A dog hmm. then. A dog seems a good idea. It is done! <laughs> Can I have some? Help yourself. Cheers. Thank you. Right, we need to use the empty bottle on the potion to get some. Glug. There we go. Right, now we need to make our way back to the secluded hut. Back to those role players. Because we want to join in. <laughs> No, I haven't lost my marbles and not suddenly gone all geeky. But we do need to join in the game. Because we get something out of it that we need. Cat Simon, will you carry on walking for God's sake? Right. I'll try and bend the cell bars with me bare hands. Right, if we use the potion on the role players. Should turn one of them into a dog. Triple caffeine stuff. Sure. <laughs> Let's see if it works. Whoop. Damn! We're sort of a player now. Your friend has just turned into a beagle. <laughs> a bit shocked. Why would we be? Probably just a variation in the local magical flux. Happens all the time round here. Shame we're short a player now. We'll have to find someone else to take his place. Well, obviously we'd like to do it, but we'll do it in the next video. So, see you there, peeps.